Hello and welcome to Chilly Bee Gaming. I'm Evie and today we're doing some more witchcraft and wizardry or Hogwarts Minecraft. So let's get into it. Okay, so last time we came here, and we, uh, this is Hogsmeade by the way, to put up some posters for Hermione for Spew, which is the Society for the Promotion of Elfish, Elfish Welfare, I think. And we picked up a, a quest to visit Hagrid in his hut as well while we were here, but ooh, there's some other folks, hello. In fact, there's Hagrid now! Can we not visit him here? Hello! Sir! Hagrid. Ah, there you go. Consult Hagrid about the sick moon car. Mm. Wilma Grubbly-Plank wants my opinion. All right. Mm. Well, you know, what she is describing doesn't sound too serious to me. Mooncrafts are shy creatures and not exactly bright either, but they're sturdier than you think. Mm. Just give it some time and that moon calf will pull through. Tell her she's doing everything she should be. Just keep going. Yeah. I'll tell her that. Brilliant. Thank you. I know my Hagrid accent wasn't really an accent, but I don't think I could do it. Neville, you've lost that bloody toad again, haven't you? Hmm. Uh, can I help hmm. you? I seem to have lost my toad Trevor again. I'm sure he's somewhere by the post office. Can you help me look for him? Hmm. Yes, Neville, all right. Thanks a lot. I hope you find him. Maybe you can ask around and hear if anyone has seen him. Hmm. I'll do my best, Neville. I'll do my best, mate. So I need to go and visit the lady in... Um, in the animal emporium. So near the post office, near here. Owl, hello. Uh, can we go in the post Oh, we can go in the post office. Hello, sir. I'm just looking for a toad at the moment. I will be with you momentarily. What's, what's out? Oh, just outside. Okay. All right. Just forgive me, I'm, I'm looking for a toad. I'll be with you in a moment. Hello, owl. You don't give two hoots, the owl, you know. All these workers working away. I'm just looking for a troublesome toad that consistently keeps running off. I'm starting to think that Neville's maybe not a good pet owner if he keeps losing this toad. What would a toad do for you, do you suppose? I know in Harry Potter... In the world of, obviously, Hogwarts and all that jazz. You can have a toad, an owl, or a cat. Now, the owl is obviously quite a useful pet because they can get you post and all that jazz. The cat, well, a cat's a cat, you know. They're sort of always associated with witches and things, aren't they, for some reason. I don't know why. I think it's something to do with the witches' familiar, I believe it is. But a toad. I just don't see what... what what a toad could do, but then, well, I suppose it's not my business to know. All right, hello. Mm -hmm. You're looking to send an owl? Actually, I'm looking for a toad. Mm -hmm. Are you now? I think I heard my colleagues upstairs talking about a toad earlier. Try asking upstairs. One of them may be able to help you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. do you need any help with anything? You look like you do. Ooh, okay, tell me about owls. Mm -hmm. Yes. Owls aren't magical creatures in the same way as Nifflers or Thunderbirds. They are well known to muggles, but witches and wizards possess a unique ability to communicate with owls, which means that owls have many functions in the wizarding world. Letters, parcels and howlers are all delivered by owls. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, tell me about the owl post. Mm -hmm. The owl postal service is the standard way of sending around post in the wizarding world. None of that mucking about with stamps like the muggles do. So cumbersome. Owl post simply uses owls as the mail bearer. Much more elegant. Mm -hmm. Owls deliver letters, newspapers, parcels, packages, and even howlers. In fact, owls are employed by witches and wizards to such an extent that nearly all owls in Britain are owned by the Postal Service or individual witches and wizards. Mm. Wow! Never knew that. Okay, tell me about the post office. Mm. Well, this is the equivalent of a muggle post office, but with owls delivering the letters. It's mostly used by those who don't own an owl or haven't got contact with one. Mm. All right, well, okay. Thank you for your information and, um, yeah, all right. Oh, I didn't ask him if he wanted to help. Well, we'll ask about the toad first. Okay, hi, dude. Hmm. Good day. I'm looking for a toad. Hmm. I thought I heard croaking coming for a bove earlier. I forget it was just, a, I was just hmm. imagining it. All right. 
Hello. Hmm. I'm looking for a toad. Hmm. My colleague mentioned hearing a croaking noise earlier. She's in the other room. Hmm. A, a, how are we going to get up? Oh, there's a way up. Ah, I see. Uh, okay. Uh, Madame? Is it you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Need help with anything? Sorry, I'm a little bit close. Why am I so close? Good grief. Mm -hmm. Looking for a toad. I've been hearing croaking noises coming from above all day. It's making it very difficult to, con to concentrate. Mm -hmm. So he's up there, is he? Ah, do we go up this way? Up the, up the, there. There we go. Up the, um, oh, okay. Can we up? Up there. So can we get on this? Do you suppose? Oh, oh, we can. Okay. Um. Hmm. Maybe, maybe this way. Do you suppose? Oh. Jeez Louise, this is a little bit dangerous, isn't it? I'm a child! Oh god, I fell. Good god! Let me tell you folks, it took me so long to get up to this sort of height, so now we just need to go over there. Oh god, this is, this is, this. I don't like this. Why are we, why is it, why, how did they get all the stuff up here? If there's a ladder in there now, I am going to be annoyed. Alright, let's, let's, oh! We did it, we did it, we did it, baby! See that toad. How would we have... How? Oh, God. I don't see any other way. Let's have a look at this chest. Coins, parchments, and a mysterious letter. Ooh, what's the letter? Can we can we read the letter? Let's, let's see. Oh. Ugh. <sighs> Mysterious letter. Ooh. Can we can we read it? No. Okay. Letter to be delivered November twelfth, nineteen fifty five. Posted seventy years, two months, and twelve days before that. All right. Well, can't really do anything with it by the looks of it, which is kind of a shame. Um, this is highly dangerous, you know, for a child. Oh, good grief. Very dangerous, actually. Okay. Whew. We'll ask the postmaster if he uh, wants any help, and then we will go and um, take Neville his toad back. Hello, sir. Mm. Do you need any help? Mm. We're very busy this time of year, so we're a bit behind on out on. We're very busy this time of year, so we're a bit behind on letter deliveries. We might be able to catch up if you helped. Perhaps you could get some letters out to the residents of Hogsmeade. I'll be sure to make it worth your time. Sure. Hmm. Just deliver these five letters and return to me when you're done. I will. Postponed postage. Ha ha. Yes. Well, um, sir, I think what's what's did we go through here? Oh, it's just like an undercroft. All right. Well, thank you for your um time. Okay, so we have to deliver five letters, which is fine. But we can get we can give Neville his bloody toad back. And tell him, look after the thing. More. Neville. Here. Hmm. Ah, you found him. Thank you very much. I lose stuff all the time. Yes, hmm. well. There you go. <sighs> Just be more careful next time. He's a toad. He might get squashed. All right. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, yes. One last trash. Hmm. Postponed postage. We'll do. Ooh. We'll do that first. Okay. Aha! I have my wand out at the ready. Don't really need it. <laughs> I'm just being very silly. All right. So we can post all these letters. Do them a favour. I wonder what we do with the mysterious letter, though. If anything, we have to go in here. Hello. Oh, hello. Uh, yep. Hmm. Welcome, welcome. This is Zonko's Joke Shop, the ultimate emporium for mischief. Home of the original Hiccup Sweets. Would that be Hiccup or Hiccoff? It looks like Hiccoff Sweets. And always happy to accommodate the young scoundrels of Hogwarts and Hogsmeade. Brilliant. Hmm. Now what can I do for you? I have a letter hmm. for you. Excellent. I've been waiting for this. Many thanks. 
Hmm. Okay, do you need help hmm. with anything? Why, I do, as a matter of fact, and I am grateful for any young prankster loyal to Zonko's joke shop. All right. Hmm. It's tough going with the Weasley twins about. Not only have I lost the business of my most reliable customers, now I actually have to compete with them and their shop, Weasley's Wizarding Wheezes in Diagon Alley. Hmm. Perhaps you could be of help. Spread the word. Let the students of Hogwarts know that Zonko's is still here. If you would hang these ad- advertisements up on the Hogwarts notice boards, some of the pranksters and mischief makers of the school might catch on. Hmm. Would you help me? Yeah, hmm. sure. Wonderful. Just hang these on five notice boards at Hogwarts and return to me when you're done. Brilliant. I will. Hmm. Okay, right, let's... Um, oh. All right, who else needs a letter? Is it just the shops? In... No? Is it in here? It kind of looks like it's in here. Hello? Ah, yes, yes. Here we go. Hello, sir. Hmm. I have a letter for you. Hmm. Many thanks. <laughs> Goodbye. All right. That was easy. Deliver in the mail. We'll be in a, a post... person? Post woman? I don't know what the appropriate term is. I like the term postmaster. I think that sounds great. Be a great title. I am the postmaster. Da da da. All right. Is it in here? Uh, oh. Ah yes. Hello, madam. I have a a letter for you here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank mm-hmm. you. Goodbye. All right. Fair enough. Not a problem. Going about my business, doing the deliveries. Just enjoying. Beautiful Hogsmeade. It is gorgeous, isn't it? Oh, I love it. In here. Uh, oh, oh, excuse me. Hmm. I have a letter for you. Hmm. Excellent, hmm. thank you. Okay. I think we've only one more to go. Close his door. Don't let the heat out. As it's obviously very cold here in, um, in Hogsmeade. Ah, we can deliver her letter. Mm. I have a letter for mm-hmm. you. Mm-hmm. Okay, and we also... Mm. What? Mm. Wait a minute. What 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 happened to um Let's have a look. Curable key creature consultation. Yeah. There you go. How bizarre. Mm. Okay. Pass on Hagrid's mm. advice. That's good to hear. I expected as much, but it's always good to get a second opinion. Hagrid might be a little rough around the edges, but he knows his magical creatures. Here, have this as thanks for your help. Mm-hmm. Well, thank you, madam. I appreciate it. You know? It's 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 tough work. Can I have a cat or a magical bunny? No. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, we have another letter to deliver. Is it in here? Oh. Hello. Ah, hello, sir. What what are those? Look like pilot's goggles. Hmm. Welcome to Split. Welcome to Spint Witch's Sporting Needs. We've got all things Quidditch. Are you looking to buy a broom? I actually have a letter for mm. you. Thank you. Mm. All right. Um, I don't know whether it's a good idea to, to, to get... Oh, I see you, little snitch. Come here. Thank you. We'll have a little look upstairs. I've not been in here. Would it be wise to buy a broom? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's the numbers 2001. Most professional Quidditch teams use these, even though the Firebolt is faster. Hmm. Where is the Nimbus 2001? I'm not seeing it. I am seeing another snitch, though. Can I have it? <laughs> and this chest. Uh, Quidditch goggles. Quidditch through the ages. Quidditch goggles worn by players during Quidditch matches to protect the wearer's eyes. Of course. Quidditch through the ages. A book written by Kenilworth Wisp. Detailing the history, evolution, and rules of Quidditch. First published in 1952. Brilliant! There you go. Quidditch through the ages, eh? I don't know whether we'd be a good Quidditch Quidditch player or not. Probably not, I'm guessing. Alright. Never mind. Okay, so... Have we not delivered all these letters now? Ah, J. Pippin's Potions... Hello. Apparently hmm. I have a letter for you. Oh, no I don't. Hmm. Okay. I think we just need to go and visit the postmaster then. Uh, 
Oh god, I'm all turned around. All kinds of turned around. I think the post office was up here, wasn't it? Was it not? Oh yeah, here we go. Post office. I'm sure we've delivered five letters now. Hmm. Oh, maybe we haven't. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. All right. Well, we'll continue onwards. Deliver the letters. Oh. Oh. What's this place? Good God. Good God. Uh, oh, hello. Um. I'd, okay. I'm just gonna. Yeah. All right. Hello. Hmm. Good day. This is the WWN, the Wizarding Wireless Network headquarters. I have a letter for you. Hmm. Yes. Ah, finally, I've been waiting for this. Mm -hmm. Okay. What is the WWN? Mm -hmm. New here. The WWN is a popular wizarding wireless station. That's what muggles would call a radio station. But it's powered by magic, not that electricity nonsense. Mm -hmm. Okay. What do you broadcast? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The WWN features music programs such as Witching Hour, hosted by Glenda Chittock, interactive programs like Toots, Shoots and Roots, hosted by Tilden Toots, and news bulletins like the Wizarding Wireless Network News. Features proper stars too, Celestina Warbeck and the Weird Sisters. Hmm. Well, mm -hmm. that's that's lovely. So it's a radio station. They all look a little whew, down and out, to be honest. But okay, let me just just. Ah, just... oh, okay. I thought there'd be a little bit more to it. Are these supposed to be like record? Ah, I see. So that's like the recording. Like booth, this is a sound booth, obviously, where the sound engineer would sit. Okay, we, yeah. Let's not go mad. <laughs> Alright, well. There can't be many more letters to deliver. My God, we've, we've been to every bloody house here. Okay, oh, how am I? Oh, I'm climbing up the vines. Climbing up the vines! <sighs> uh, green, welcome to Greenleaf, dear. How can I help you? We mostly carry herbs and alchemical ingredients. That sort of thing. I have a letter for you. Mm. Excellent. Thank you very mm. much. Have I been in here? I don't I don't think I've been in Oh, hello. What are you doing with that pot plant? I'm just going to have a little nosy round in your shop. Don't mind me. Ooh. Just to see what we can see. If there's any snitches, collectibles or anything of the like. Invigoration draft. A thousand magical herb, herbs and fungi. Written by the appropriately named Felida Spore. This book contains certain magical plants often used in potions. Ah, magical water plants. Okay. Also known as magical Mediterranean plants and their properties, this is a book about herbology by Hadrian Whistle. Bundle of fluxweed. Untreated gillyweed. Okay. I mean, all right. We're gathering up quite a collection of potions, ingredients and things now. And coin, obviously. All right. Well, we, we, we came, we saw, we had a look downstairs. We'll have a look upstairs first before we disappear. Make sure there's no golden snitches or anything of the variety. I feel like we could climb up this. But then I... I, mm, I don't know. Could we... Can we... Oh, there's not enough vines. Ah! Coin bundle of fluxweed. Fluxweed even. Untreated killyweed. Brilliant. Brilliant! Okay, this way? No. All right, well, it was worth a nosy, I suppose. Could you could you climb up? Okay, I will fall if I'm not careful. I don't think we can climb up. Oh, yes, we can. There you go. Genuinely, genuinely very curious now. Any more letters to be delivered? Nope, not in here. In here? Hello, sir. I'm sure we've delivered more than five letters now. Hmm. A young admirer of the arts enters my shop. Welcome, my name is Dominic Maestro. How may I help you? I have a letter for hmm. you. Hmm. Okay. I mean, I'm literally delivering letters to everybody here. Can I? Can I? Yeah. Oh. Well, God bless it. 
Wait, ooh, it's all these musical instruments. All right. Well, thank you, sir. Good grief. I'm literally delivering the mail to everybody here. Ooh, take that gold, thank you. Oh, you don't look very happy. Hmm. Ernest Potts, Urns and Potts. How do you do? I have a letter for you. Hmm. Hmm. Can I help you with anything? Hmm. Yeah. Ah, you have an interest in urns. I have had my eyes on a very special urn for all my life. Ancient and near forgotten, but not by me. Hmm. This urn is in a dungeon beneath a ruin in the Forbidden Forest near Hogwarts. I tried to retrieve it myself many years ago, but I didn't succeed. It's dangerous down there, and I barely got out alive. Perhaps I hmm. could get it. Ask me again when you've learned a bit more magic. Hmm. All right. Well, I did try to help Urn. Urn get his urn. <laughs> okay. Any more letters? Really? There's more? Good grief. Mm -hmm. Slugs and Jiggers Apothecary, Hogsmeade Branch. We have just about everything you could need for potion brewing. You can also visit our store in Diagon Alley if you don't find what we need. If you don't find what we need. Hmm. Perhaps you could have more, you'll could have you have more luck there. Anyway, hmm. what can I do for you? I have a letter hmm. for you. Okay. Hmm. She's been waiting for it. Okay. Hello? Is there anybody in? What is this place, I wonder? Oof. <gasps> it's locked with the Alohomora charm. We could unlock it. Well, God bless it. No. What? Is this like some kind of art gallery or something? Maybe? Hello. Mm. Be with you in a moment. Mm. Okay. I don't know what this place is. I'm gonna leave. Is there a sign? Oh, is it like a tailor shop? Okay. That's fine. Can we? The Flying Apron Bakery. Ooh, sounds nice. Hello, sir. Cool. Welcome to the Flying Apron Bakery. What can I do for you? I have a letter for hmm. you. Hmm. There you go. Perfect. Nice. I like me a bakery. Do you like me a bakery? Well, thus far, though, unfortunately, we... Um, we don't really seem to have um, concluded this quest, which seems a little bit odd. Because we were only supposed to deliver five letters. So far we've delivered about ten. Hmm. Dogweed and death cat. Potions and potion supplies. What do you want? I have a letter hmm. for you. Oh, thank you. Huh. Goodbye. All right. Well. Apples. What's down here? Just out of the curiosity of it all. Any snitches? Any boxes? Anything for me to find, do you suppose? Doesn't look like it, does it? Okay, well, I will leave you to your business, good sir. Oh, and we will leave it there for today. Next time we will possibly go back to Hogwarts and um, do some more quests up there. Just see what else we can do. Speak to Hermione. Maybe, maybe she'll give us like a good spell. Ooh, might be a shout. Well, anyway, until next time, be safe. Be good and look after yourselves.